Hello everyone, this is Adotets here and today I'm going to show you how to install Cyanogen Mod 10 on Xperia P devices. We'll also work on other Xperia lineups. So let's get started. Just connect your phone to your PC and open up the storage in the PC. Copy up these two files, download link in the description. and paste them in the storage of the phone and then open up this unofficial cyanogen mod file and extract the boot image to the desktop and you will get this boot image copy this image and paste it in fastboot folder if you don't have fastboot folder video link in the description copy and replace if it asks and hold on shift and right click and click on open command window here and then we will need to type in some commands so commands are fastboot flash boot boot dot image and hit enter and it will ask the phone to be connected in fast boot mode for that disconnect the phone power it off and once it is off Press and hold the volume up key and connect it to USB and the blue LED will lit. This shows that the phone is connected in fast boot mode. And then command window will act and will fast boot the files. And we are done with the computer. Get rid of it and then unplug your phone and power it on. And when you see free Xperia logo, keep on tapping volume down key to boot into recovery. And once you are in recovery, volume up and down will be act as up and down and power button will be for the selection. Select install zip from SD card, select choose zip from SD card, then select unofficial cyanogen mode file and select yes. and it will flash the files be patient it will take time and once it is complete select go back and select wipe data factory reset select yes delete all user data and it will erase all the contacts and applications on your phone select install zip from SD card select choose zip from SD card select gaps select yes install gaps and it will install the package and once it is complete select go back and go to wipe data factory reset select yes once everything is complete select reboot system now it will reboot your phone It will take its time so be patient
and then you will see the welcome screen set up the phone according to your wants and then you will be on your new ROM sound engine mode you can check it by going into about phone and there you will see bunch of sound engine mode statistics and the phone is in the 4.1.2 jelly bean android operating system and this ROM is pre-rooted you don't need to root it again the super user is pre-installed in it and this was pretty much about the rom please rate the video comment down below for your queries and subscribe for more videos